guys this is Tracy I just wanted to um, do a quick video um, of my little haul from food max this afternoon I don't even really shop at food max and um, I'm a little bit of a snob when it comes to shopping at the grocery store but you guys have been getting so many good deals especially you people on the East Coast and down south so I've been trying to go to the stores that are comparable to the ones that you guys are getting these good deals at um, and Food Max, like I said, isn't somewhere I typically go. I, I don't really like their produce and I'm more of a health conscious shopper, believe it or not. So some of the stuff that I normally buy, they don't have, but I went in there just to run in today, literally to get, um, some sausage links and some ground beef because I want to make some spaghetti for my daughter, um, and I for dinner tonight. And, um, the other reason for this video is just to share the goodness of looking for clearance wherever you go. I coupon now, but I've always been a deal hunter, clearance shopper. So, you know, it's just amazing to me what I'm able to do with coupons now. Um, I would have bought the same quantity of all of this stuff at the price that it was marked down at just clearance. But I was so happy to have had um, coupons for this right here in particular. It's so funny because when I clipped the coupon for this today... I was like, I'm probably never going to use this. And I didn't even take my binder in the store with me. I just happened to have a Ziploc bag with some grocery store coupons that I hadn't sorted yet. And I said, well, let me take it in here just in case. So this Sara Lee um, cooked ham, the coupon, I think I have one in my pocket still. Hold on a second. I do. I'm sorry. The all NBA All-Star game is on in the background. Excuse me for the noise. Okay. So, yeah, I, I think this came from last Sunday's paper. I'm not sure if it was the Red Plum or Smart Source. You guys know that's not my area of expertise. You guys are better at that than me. But I pulled this thing out when I was um, getting ready to cut it. I'm like, I'm probably never, ever going to use this. I hadn't even ever seen this product before, actually. And lo and behold, I go straight to the clearance bin for the meat section. And they just had tons of it in there. Well, not tons, but a lot. I got six for free. I'm going to freeze this. I'm sure I'm probably going to share with family because I don't really eat a whole lot of um, lunch meat and make sandwiches that often. But I'm happy to have them on hand and to help people out. Um, this Evergood wasn't on clearance. I was, I paid full price for that. And the ground beef as well. So let me move that out the way. But let's get to the other stuff that I got on clearance. New York style maple pork sausage for $1.49. Again, I typically like to stay with the turkey sausage because I, um, when I'm doing right, I eat clean like 80% of the time, which is where this is going to come in. I have never tried chicken sausage before. Turkey sausage I do, and I actually have uh, acquired a taste for it, so I crave it over pork sausage, which I thought would never happen. But I want to try and incorporate something else so I don't get so bored with um, turkey products. And anyway, these were on clearance also for $1.49. This one is a spicy Italian chicken sausage, so I guess that would go like a pasta dish or something. Um, or, no, um, if you don't use whole wheat or um, whole grain pasta, you could do um, quinoa or a spaghetti squash, which I um, will replace with pasta. And then we have the breakfast links, also $1.49. I'm not even going to explain myself, but the little Debbies, somebody, you guys need to take those coupons off my hands. I'm a nutty bar fanatic, and I got these for my daughter, something quick if we're in a hurry for breakfast for school, so, yeah, all of this that you see here was a grand total of $20 and like 51 cents, so, anyway, that's it. I'll let you guys get back to your evening, but I wanted to just do a recording and um, just explain to you guys, please, please, please always look for yellow tags, orange tags, Kmart has red tags, um, wherever you go, look for those tags, shop clearance, meat, somebody asked me on Instagram the other day, what do you do with the meat, you freeze it, you buy it and you freeze it and you use it when you need it. That's how you maximize on the sale price and your savings. I even get fresh vegetables and freeze them and use them later. Um, that's the best. I mean, this is well over a month's worth of meat. 
that I have here, um, you know, for breakfast and lunch. So for $20, you can't beat it with two full price items included. So anyway, Food Max, thank you guys for your generosity today. And thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your evening and happy hunting this week with the deals. Make sure you follow me on Instagram at Tracy Blogs underscore F. FYI. And the FYI is for your information. I'm sure you guys knew that though. Anyway, have a good night. Bye.